right, we're gonna watch this, and then I got three more reactions, and then we're gonna see where the night leads us. It might be a, uh, a short stream, I don't know, but we're gonna see where it leads us. Okay, so, so look, because we're coming to the end of 2022. And then Sorry, 2023, just want to say that. This year was, uh, well, def definitely another year. I thought I would do a timeline on everything that happened this year. That Jared Allen? I know he I know he probably get comments like this all the time. That's got to be Jared Allen, bro. If Jared Allen did YouTube. That we actually care <laughs> about. Because whenever I do see these timelines every year, they're always so fucking boring to me. Like, it's either all about one thing, like what happened in politics, or it's all about another thing, like what happened in pop culture. But I want to blend all of it, like add the politics, pop culture, memes, social media, entertainment, you know, you, you get the point. So all without right. further ado, let's go over the 2022. Okay. January 2022. At the start of the year, it didn't seem too bad at first, to be honest. Nothing really important happened, except that whole COVID shit was still going worse than 2020 2020 was a pretty bad year i ain't gonna lie 2020 was a bad year like i mean a bad year but eh. Hold on. i honestly forgot covid was still i feel like everybody has like a worse year in their life but i think everybody can agree that on 2020 was one of the worst damn it's happening until right now omnicron or omni i don't fucking care what it's called it's at its peak and it's tumbling us down back to peak quarantine time Ooh. There actually is a new variant out there as well. I just want to say that. So y'all be safe. There is a new variant out there. By the time I'm reacting to this on the 4th of January, there is a new variant out there apparently. So be safe. Times. Every country was pretty much experiencing the highest number of COVID cases they had ever seen. The United States reached a record 5 million cases in one yep. week. Even the UK recorded a record 192,000 cases in one day. Huh. You thought their food would have killed them. Ew. Euphoria released its second season, giving some girls... By the way, I've never seen Euphoria. Is that a time with Daniel girl? So she won't let me see. Even more fictional characters they can attach themselves to and copy their most toxic traits. I mean, it was needed to be said. Come on, am I am I lying? Kim Kardashian and Floyd Mayweather were sued over their alleged crypto scam they promoted. The amount of celebrities that got away with this NFT and crypto scam shit was honestly pretty crazy at the time. The hunga tunga. We just did. It was my ex, but we just saw, we just saw Logan. Crazy. A hunger humpy volcano erupted on January 15th. I hope I said that right. Which was one of the largest recorded volcano eruptions. Dang, I didn't know Korea. that. It then caused a tsunami that caused devastation to the west coast of Tonga Tab this country. But something even more Tonga Tapu. Microsoft Tonga -tapu. came out and announced that they're going to buy Activision Blizzard for 68.7 billion in an all-cash deal. If the deal B billion, I'm set for eternity. What does actually go through? They'll own the rights to games like Call of Duty, Tony Hawk, Overwatch, Warcraft, and all that. Which means also they could technically make those games only work on Xbox. They so could. everyone would have to buy an Xbox. You would have to buy an Xbox. Got one. No one wants to buy an Xbox. Elon Musk starts to look for a clinical trial director to start testing brain chip implants on. This is crazy. I, it, bro, as far as this sounds, but don't do it, bro. Because I feel like it just takes one flick of a switch. You with Elon now. Elon controls you. Humans. You no, know, there's like a thousand movies that tell us that this won't turn out right. But hey, you know, just just do it. Elon. Right. Elon. And to end it off on a pretty sad note, Rihanna officially announced she was pregnant with ASAP Rocky's baby. It ain't fair, bro. Which then led to a group of n who never had a chance to acting out in multiple ways. Some crying how they'll never get a chance. They never had one anyways. Some lashing out and getting furious over the fact she did this to them. People she can doesn't dream. know them. And some pleading to God and asking why he would ever do this. ASAP Rocky was officially target number one after that day. Also, the memes of sure this were things like NFTs, Push and Pee, and Wordle. God, this fell off. February 2022. Did. We started off this month with some pretty interesting things all around. Like on the first day of the month, Tom Brady <laughs> announced his retirement from the NFL. You know, surely he won't change change his mind two months later for no right. absolute reason rockstar finally confirmed that gta 6 was in development the day this happened was so surreal and i'm saying it's a twitter was going bonkers when this when uh rockstar sent that tweet out bro twitter was going because nobody bananas. thought it was gonna happen everyone was cheering and praising and dancing around just saying you. something was actually happening people were already making twitter gta 6 update accounts and twitter accounts counting down the days until gta 6 would come out and the hype very much made sense because up until this point there was not a single word about gta, GTA 6 about not a word. All, while we were all celebrating mark zuckerberg was having the worst day of his life mark zuckerberg's net worth dropped by 31 <laughs> billion dollars in one day which bumped him to being the 10th richest person in the world oh no guys oh no i'm the 10th richest person in the world Oh no, my life is over. Uh...
the 10th richest person in the world. How is he gonna recover? I show speed started to blow up around this month as well. And look, look, I know people are gonna say he was already big and obviously he was, but this was around the time he started that whole talking Ben thing, which I consider the catalyst to his fame. The Rams won the Super Bowl. And a couple yep. days later, Brittany Griner was arrested over carrying vape cartridges in a Russian airport. Surely this won't lead to one of the worst trades in US history, embarrassing the entire country. Like that's, that's not gonna happen. I think we were streaming when that happened too. I think, if I remember, um, I don't know. Cause I, bro, I remember that. Oh my gosh, bro, this is, ah, this man. I remember I seen the thing about um the top G's. By the way, they're both. I seen the fact that they're both arrested behind bars. Um, it's tough. I don't know what happened, but hopefully they'll be all right. But um, yeah, I seen the thing they talk about uh. Saying uh, they said that Griner should have stayed locked up for what she did. I mean, I don't know. I have no input on that. Are they out? Are they out? I, I saw they might be out. I don't know. But I swear, last time I checked, they're still in. Maybe they're out. That's impossible to happen. The show Arthur ended this month as well, ending one of the most goaded kids. Oh, it finally it, Arthur ended last year. In February, I didn't even know that TV shows to have ever existed. I didn't, even, I didn't even know it was still going. That's crazy. Arthur was goaded. I love Arthur. I personally included one of my favorite scenes in media of all time. I told you, you the two. To <laughs> a couple of days later, an Ooh. angry man in Russia was hatching a plan to do some evil. Russia invaded the Ukraine on February 24, Show 2022. Did. It causes mass panic in every country, and people start preparing for the worst in every part of the world. People all speak out in support I thought of the Ukraine did too. and change their profile pictures and bios to the picture of the Ukraine flag until they eventually removed it after about a week. Now, I'm not here to tell the full timeline of the war because, you know, that's too much of politics and I don't have that much of a brain to do it. And also still going on. But hey, Elden Ring released the day right after. It was already breaking records right after its release. Like having 953,000 concurrent players playing the game in the second weekend after its release. Crazy. It was a pretty good game for like the first month. But just like every story mode game, everyone beat it and moved on to the next thing. The of memes course. of this month were things like the Mega Mind No Bitches, I Love Lean, and Talking never Ben, March 2022. Oh, Russia God. really started to face a cancellation that was never seen before in human history. Like no one to this day can face the type of cancellation Russia did in the beginning of this month. Is it me or is it giving me, is it giving Corey Kenshin vibes a little bit? That's not a bad thing, obviously. He's just giving me Corey Kenshin vibes. I don't know. I don't know. On the first day, the U.S. banned Russian flights from American airspace. Then all the followings banned in Russia right after. Apple products, Apple Pay, MasterCard, Maybe I'm tweaking, Visa, I don't know. Nike products, McDonald's, CNN, cryptocurrency, Instagram, TikTok, Twitter, Reddit, Snapchat, Microsoft, and Facebook. Not even R. Kelly could top being canceled as much as Russia. No, 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 no. The next day. Not features like, you know, like, not like visual features like his face he don't look like he, he don't look like Kurt kitchen obviously but like i don't know kim kardashian and kanye were officially confirmed legally it's just like the presence like the kind of a presence i don't know he's single by divorcing oh you're saying Even yeah he do he definitely do let jared down the batman movie released becoming one of the top 10 dc comic based openings of all time with 134 million dollars on opening weekend it also gave guys another celebrity that they have zero chance i'm gonna lie i watched that batman movie twice and i fell asleep both times so to simp over russia legalized piracy of movies games and more due to companies blocking their content in russia don't know why people acted so surprised over this acting like they don't do it as well tom brady announced he was back from yep. his retirement breaking the record for the shortest retirement in human history netflix and his family left him. started to face its true downfall the downfall that was soon i know i know you've seen that tom brady picture of his son Hey man, some some bro, come to on. Escalate man. After That's kind of crazy. They're going to require people to pay for users outside That's of their That's kind of crazy. Share accounts. To say people got pissed off was a fing understatement. Fortnite removed building for the new season for the first time ever. I never thought this day would come. It was absolute pandemonium in the community, leaving kids crying over the fact that they wasted four years practicing advanced building techniques instead oh, of going outside. Right. This was pretty much Fortnite Kids 9 11. Joe Biden warned that Whoa, a quote unquote okay. real food shortage will happen due to sanctions they put on Russia. His kids are okay. Year, so I have zero clue what he was on about. And of course, that, that's kind of crazy. This entire month, the Will Smith and Chris Rock slap on uh, March 27, yep. 
to, Will Smith walked on stage in the middle of Chris Rock speaking at the Oscars and proceeded to smack <laughs> leading to one of the most craziest days on social media. You also had people arguing with Will and saying they would do the same. All you saw that day were memes about the situation and you really Actual couldn't escape the story for like two months. No. I swear the news were tracking Will Smith and Chris Rock at the time's whereabouts like they were level one threats on the FBI's most wanted list. I can guarantee you it was not that deep. Moving on, Ezra Miller was arrested for the first time at a karaoke bar after becoming agitated. The start of a good yep. arc that was to come. Also, Moon Knight released as well. It was going to be the Flash. Now, I don't I, I don't know what they're going to do. I think they should make, um, because they got a Flash movie coming out, I think, next year or this year. I'm not sure. But I think what they should do, since Ezra Miller wants to, you know, be stupid um, and get arrested. But uh, what's it called? What's his face? Um, the dude that does um the Flash D uh series on CW, he should be the Flash in the DC universe. I think so. That's the thing I don't get, bro. Like I know some of these guys can't do it, like you know, like the like the you know the TV series and stuff like that, cause the movies. But I feel like you can do it. You can do it, cause then nobody will see no off. You know, like say um uh, what's his face um. Like Ben Affleck when he was Batman, and then they had a series like some other series, like some TV series. You know, I'm looking for Ben Affleck. I'm not seeing some you know whack a mole coming as Batman. I'm like, it, it just don't, don't got the same feel. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? Like, ah, um, which down. was a pretty fire show. That's just the me though. This month were things like the Chris Rock slap. Like how Marvel do it. Like you expect to see like the you know the original you know Mark like Mark Ruffalo as the Hulk. It now obviously in She Hulk. I didn't watch She Hulk. I heard that she was ass. Not wasting my time. But you know what I'm saying? It's like that kind of mindset. You see the big movie stars in the TV shows, like, you know, the characters. That's it. Moon Knight, the Batman movie, My Brother in Christ, and British People. April 2022. We oh, God. With a huge W in my eyes. The House passed a bill that federally decriminalized marijuana, considering that some people literally have gotten Recipes more jail time that. for this than some grapers and meadows. I'll take it as a win. No, the Reddit game R slash Play Store, sure. giving everyone the ability That's why to put was a better. single pixel down on a white canvas every five minutes. Big streamers and communities cemented hey, their place on it by moving in hordes to different spots and causing a lot of unnecessary beef for no fucking reason WQC. You people sending threats to each other over this people getting in screaming matches over their territory and overall just showing that the future generations will never be at peace with each other we couldn't even be at peace with the little reddit game possibly the worst movie in existence released as well morbius flopping at the box office on opening never seen it never plan on seeing it i thought about it i think we reacted to it I said maybe I, uh, I said I might go see Weekend it. Weekend with thirty-nine but. million dollars made. It was so bad, in fact, that it turned into an entire meme of people saying it was good to get people to watch it to troll them. I really have never seen that up until Morbius's point. It came out that BTS was expected to serve in the South Korean Army. It's mandatory for them to do the really? eighteen months of military service. And just like the Fortnite kids with no building, this was every K-pop stands nine eleven. Elon Musk bought nine point two percent of Twitter stock worth almost three billion after. Oh God. 9% is worth 3 billion. God, dog. It is Twitter. It's one of the hugest platforms. Ever. They're free speech Oh, my policies. God. Jada Pinkett Smith came out and said she wished Will Smith didn't smack Chris Rock at the Oscars. Yeah, that only confirmed even more to the public that she was a bitch. The Jada... That's right. The Pinkett Smith hate train was never leaving after that one. It still hasn't. It still hasn't. If, she, if Jada Pinkett Smith made a tweet about, like, uh, something bad against Will Smith. Scientists decided to broadcast Earth's location to aliens, which Stephen Hawking warned them not to do before passing away. Leave it to scientists and engineers to not listen to warnings and just do whatever the f they want. The movie Recipe Sonic the Hedgehog 2 came out, and overall it was just really a good movie. It showed us that some companies seen can the actually second adapt one. the beloved series in a right way. The Johnny Depp versus Amber Heard trial officially started on April. Boy, the memes Johnny on Depp this one. Amber Heard for $50 million for defamation of his name, while Amber Heard countersued for $100 million saying it was just self-defense. Whoever told her to counter sue back for that much was definitely setting her up. This led to one of the most goofiest cases to ever be televised. And it was good to hear about for like a solid month, I would say, until it was viciously milked by the news. YouTubers and streamers were making like a hundred videos on this every day. And you could be sure that anything that happened in that courtroom was gonna be released as news in some type of stupid way, even if it didn't need to be. There was a app also that started to blow up around this time for some reason. Be real. I still don't know. I, I gotta be real. I barely be using it. But the thing about Amber Heard, bro, I, I, now she broke. I don't know where she at right now, man. What it does? I and guess what? She was in D.C. Crazy. I still don't know 
why it is. Elon Musk made his first offer to buy Twitter at $41 billion, starting the war for Elon buying Twitter. Russia warned the US and other countries that they would face unpredictable consequences Be against ass. people who armed the Ukraine. It's you know, right, it's something, it's something. Thing. And of course, nothing ever happened, so they were capping as usual. And Ezra Miller got arrested again for a second time in Hawaii over throwing a chair at a woman's head. The worst like get this get this thing out of here bro worst part is his crimes only got worse and worse after this there was never a sane headline with ezra miller after this and netflix started to seep in their else it got confirmed that netflix was set to lose 50 billion dollars after losing 200 000 subscribers Jeez. twitter officially accepted elon musk 44 billion dollar offer to buy the platform and trump said the same day he wasn't going to come back to twitter if he gets unbanned and will stay using true social which was a pretty big must what is i i never heard of true social i never heard of that. What, what what is too true uh, true soul uh, true true social jesus christ i couldn't say that actually uses true souls megan true fox social. and mgk reveal that they drink each other's blood confirming them as is that that is gross. Couple ever to the public. There was never a sane headline with these two after that. From that day on, everyone just kind of looked at them like that weird couple. Megan Fox is bad as hell. Always hiding a corner and whispering each other's ear weirdly. Funny enough, those type of couples always lasted the longest, and they're still going as strong. So I guess Megan Fox is bad as hell. Memes of this month were things like Morbius, Jaden Smith's political and economic state. J of the world speech thing, Guandale Dingle, Elon Musk Twitter deal, and of Wondale course, the Johnny here. Depp and Amber Heard trial, May 2022. At the start of this month, Amber Heard really started to get sh on online. People didn't like her so much, they got her removed to less than 10 minutes of screen time in Aquaman 2 because of a petition. Like, she was such a b that a petition actually worked. Petitions never work, nobody cares about that. Also, Dave Chappelle got attacked on stage by a he man did. who rushed the stage. Apparently, he was mad over the jokes Dave Chappelle made about the LGBTQ and trans community. You know, I'll never understand. Dave Chappelle's an OG, bro, so, you know what I'm saying? You know, you can't... I understand some people, you know, but Dave Chappelle... I imagine, like, like my dog stepped... Yeah, facts. My dog stepped on the B. But, like, back in Dave Chappelle, bro, the LGBTQ community, you know what I'm saying? Um, the uh, lettuce, bacon, turkey sandwich community. God, I'm playing I'm, I'm joking, obviously. But back then, for him, it wasn't as, you know, big as it is today. So, I mean, you know. Understand why people go to comedy shows where they make fun of everybody as a job and get all pissed right. off and distaste once they hear some type of joke that was too edgy or dark for them. Mm. The attacker even had a knife and was planning to actually hurt him even more. And I don't care how distasteful you think a comedian's joke is, killing someone over a joke will never make sense in any type of world. The Black Lives co-founder admitted she lied when she denied using the group's six million dollar home for business. And this month, the whole right. BLM organization pretty much got exposed for capping the whole time. It was okay. a damn shame because it gave racist people a complete up on us now because now right. once you say black lives matter they all just say it's a scam and they don't believe in it even though the message and the organization are completely two different things they are. you know what's worse than racism in america young thug and gunna getting arrested on may 9th young thug and gunna were arrested on charges of participation in street gang activity but that boy free, that boy gonna free. As well as 26 other YSL affiliates in a 56 count indictment. Okay. And police also allege that YSL is a gang, as you guys know, and affiliated with the Bloods gang. And just like K-pop stands losing BTS for 18 months, this day was Raps 9-11. Everyone was shocked and bewildered that these two could even get arrested. But I mean, is it really that surprising? If you look at one music video with Young Thug and Gunna and YSL, you'll probably see like 10 illegal things going on in the background. Free Melly. North Korea reported it's- I ain't gonna lie, Melly, Melly stuck in there. You won't see the day of life. Country's first coronavirus infection, biggest cap of the year. Netflix took another L by announcing they're laying off 150 more employees. And another disease was slowly starting to creep on us after we just finished fighting COVID. Oh, yeah, monkeypox. Monkey monkeypox scared everyone because it wasn't like having COVID. Like, if you had COVID, yeah, you would get sick. But I think I would rather feel 10 times sick by COVID than having literal cess pimples popping up all over my body. It started to be talked about a lot online at this time, and people were worried about another lockdown happening. Happening. But don't worry because it kind of just got forgotten and no one ever mentioned it again. Like, Je if I speak, I'm in trouble. Genuinely, what you don't, you don't need years? him. Meanwhile, Stranger Things season four released this month. This was pretty much Netflix's last board in the chamber, and yep. I had to save them this year, or they were sinking to the ground. And it did save them, at least for a little bit. Stranger Things season four broke the record for most minutes watched in a Show week on did. Netflix. And just as the TikTok girlies like to do, they cling on to another unhinged fictional character and simultaneously ruined a fan base for good. Oh yep. my god, bro. Oh, hell. The NRA held its convention from May 27th <laughs> to May 29th. And if you're not from the United States, and oh, don't know what the NRA is. NRA 
NRA stands for National Rifle Association. So America has an association for guns. Yeah, I see why people can't take America very serious sometimes. And obviously I people don't. weren't too happy with this considering it was a couple days after a mass shooting at an elementary school. But hey, I mean, I even know that what happened. other country would you be able to carry a rocket launcher? What's up, but convention? picture oh, yeah, is that? Picture. And to end off this month, a man threw pie at the Mona Lisa. Yeah. Why did he do it? No one knows to this day. All we do know, though, is that it led to a pattern of people attacking pieces of art around the world as a protest for... Uh, uh, I'll say, I feel like, uh, I can't say that because I feel like you're going to flip the Harry Potter script on me. I feel like everybody should watch Harry Potter. I know that's what you're going to say. And I don't know. I, I mean, uh, I don't know. But it... Stranger Things is a really good show. It's a really good show. Throwing every types of vegetables and food to protest for climate change, which, you know, I, I guess. The memes of this month were things like Better Call Saul, the Sonic movie, and Morbius yep. was still a meme. June 2022. This month, we started off with a big f***ing dub. Johnny Depp won his defamation he did. for 15 million against Amber Heard. Get that bag, son. Amber Heard son. won 2 million in the countersuit. Everyone was happy and joyous and frolicking around that it finally ended. Meanwhile, I was just happy that the news could finally stop covering this f***ing case and move on to more important things the boys season three started releasing weekly which meant everyone Haven't started witnessing it. absolute top tier peak fiction internet explorer shut down after 26 years as well which is the amount of time anyone had ever last used it the warriors defeated the celtics and won the nba championship yeah. and everyone's favorite light skin drake possibly released the worst album in his entire discography i still to this day have not met a single person that likes this album vince mcmahon stepped down as a ceo of wwe he this did. was huge since he was the face of wwe for pretty much our entire childhood Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just, I'm comparing it because I haven't watched Harry Potter. I'm not comparing to both of the shows because I can't. I haven't watched them. But I know it. I, I, the amount of, like, like, everybody I know has, heard, you know, heard of Harry Potter. So, it's definitely goaded by that fact. Stranger Things, it's, it's not like Harry Potter. I'll admit that. I'll admit that. I just haven't watched Harry Potter. Or read a book. I mean, it was because uh, Harry Potter. he was facing certain allegations for women that were starting to seem true. But he did create WWE. President Joe Biden faced a tragic injury to himself. This dude, what? He was fine after. <laughs> up to 20, uh, he's all right. He's all right. Months. And at that moment, everyone. Well, I can't really laugh at that, that even though he's all right. Long. No different than Santa Claus or the Tooth Fairy. It was all just a dream. Meanwhile, Netflix fired Bitcoin. another 300 employees. You see what I mean when I said not even Stranger Things could save them? And the United States government proved to make another dumb decision like they usually do. The Supreme oh, no. Court overturned Roe versus Wade, meaning that each state had the choice to ban abortions if they wanted to. Yep. This day was hell for social media. Like, this is by far the most 19th century type choice the Supreme Court has ever made in a while. On some good news, though, R. Kelly was finally sentenced to 30 years in prison. They could have done this like 20 years ago but i mean hey we could take it as a win also Dude, i know how to read yes there's so many more books than just the harry potter books name 10 books then okay um i i could literally say anything and it could be a book literally that, that I, anything that's a book um now and later that's another book like i could i could literally just say anything it is a book for the youtube community this was the same month where technoblade sadly passed away due to he did rest in it was peace a very sad day rest in paradise technoblade the memes of this month were things like yeet drake's album flop the title the forehand I'm, t I'm telling you like those could be titles if I, I could just look up like anything that's probably a book and guy dolly mini and the ace attorney clown girl if you ask me have i read a book in a minute uh, i have not read a book in a minute i ain't gonna lie to you July 2022. Minions The Rise of Gru released on July 1st. Becoming one of the first movies to actually... You just didn't name 10 books then. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I haven't read those books. I just told you the names of them. To utilize it. meme culture and actually help them in movie sales. The creator of Yu-Gi-Oh! Kazuki Takashi passed away in a snorkeling accident. Rest he in did. paradise Rest to in one peace. of the goats. TikTok officially confirmed that China does indeed access US user data after they got called out. Wow, what a shocker! It's not like your for you page representing exactly what you talk about every day gave it away. Elon Musk terminated right. his deal for buying Twitter and right after Twitter threatened to sue him. I can't blame them. For $44 billion, I would have been mad. Too. Sesame Street's amusement park Sesame Place got called out for being racist to multiple children in different videos. Like on one of the videos, you just see the character flat out denying a hug from one of the black kids. And on Whoa. another video, the character just comes in and pushes that child to the ground. Bro, did not have to come in like this. It shouldn't be funny, but it okay. kind of is. Oh, so in this month, an odd bald headed man started to appear more on people's TikTok for you pages. I remember the specific day where I just started to see Andrew Tate on my TikTok. Yep. 
Never heard of Andrew Tate a day in my life till the month of July, bro. For you page for some reason. Andrew Tate pretty much started dominating social media for the summer and giving guys who have no father figure an online one to cling to. One clip you were seeing him talking about how bad vaping is. And on another clip you were seeing him say if you don't drink sparkling water, you're a p I feel like the world with Andrew Tate and society completely changed. The Roblox oof sound was removed from the game due to a licensing issue, which it meant was. that it ended one of the most iconic sound effects and ending an iconic era of memes from the game. The worst part though is that it could have been completely prevented. Now, I'm not going to go fully into the case, but just know this has been going on for years and uh, it was definitely Roblox's fault that they lost the sound. To end it off on a good note though, Mr. Beast finally hit 100, 100 million subscribers on YouTube, making him the second channel ever to hit 100 million subscribers that's not an organization or company next to PewDiePie. The memes of this... I, right now, he is the most subscribed YouTuber on the platform. Not counting two series, not counting two series or Coco like Melon. The boys, Andrew Tate, Homelander, and LeBron James Homelander. Multiverses. August 2022. Starting off this month was not good <laughs> at all. Brittany Griner was officially sentenced to nine years in a rush. She was, military. she was. Yeah, still a bad trade, should have kept her locked up. Doja Cat shaved her hair and eyebrows, becoming the... She did. Punching back for TikTok and Twitter memes for the entire month. I mean, that was a very rough month for her. Donald Trump's house was raided by the FBI. Now the FBI needs to that. get the rest of everybody in politics. Also, a certain music artist started to blow up. Thought Some I was say she you. was the savior to music. Some say she was was a reincarnation of Beethoven, Ice Spice. Ice Spice was blowing up at that time because of her song Munch, proving that talent really doesn't matter anymore. And also proving that you can really become a one verse wonder. Also, don't forget Drake's creepy ass pying his hands all over her like he usually does with the newest upcoming female rapper. She did have everyone saying Munch for like a month though. She did, she did. I ain't gonna lie, it, 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 the song was kinda catchy, I ain't gonna lie. After that, no, nobody paid attention to the song. We all realized what, what we were listening, you know, what we was, intend on looking for so in these videos i don't say new york lingo like riz and getting sturdy was starting to become mainstream and i already know it was big before but it started to reach that point where suburban white kids knew what getting sturdy was and what riz was and that's when you know something is mainstream the reckoning came yep. down for everybody's favorite top g andrew Tate top got banned g. on instagram and facebook he and did. later on every single social media platform would do the same thing yep. even 13 year old boys with not only no father figure in real life but even one online andrew Tate got closest to how russia got canceled in the beginning of this year it was at the point where even people that didn't like him kind of wondered was it that serious you gotta admit they treated bro like a class five level one threat to humanity at some point <laughs> things of this month were things like andrew tate walter white nathaniel b and fortnite's dragon ball collab we started off this Rest month crazy. Queen Elizabeth II passed away at 96 years old Rest on September beast. 8th. It was a very sad day for the Brits. Some people were sad, and many more were happy. I've never seen someone's death get more slandered in my entire life than when the Queen passed away. You had people smoking on her pack, making edits of TikTok of her and laughing, putting Rip Bozo on their bio tour. I don't even like the Royal Gala Family. Wild. Even I was like, damn, yo, y'all are September crazy. The Navy came out and admitted that they have UFO videos but won't release it to the public because it would harm national security. I'm more shocked. shocked People really thought the government wasn't lying when they said they didn't have any proof on aliens. Also, shock, the government is lying. Oh, this monstrosity of a video. If I go missing, you know what happened. What happened? Oh, God. She, after this, actually managed to get an online following she, she live did. on the internet for some reason. There's no saving this generation. A certain conspiracy theory started around the chess community. Hans Neiman, a professional chess player, managed to beat Magnus Carlsen from Norway in the Sinquinfield World Cup. But a rumor was started saying he used vibrating aliens. Whoa, that's not, nah, nah, nah. The drama was surprisingly big for some reason, and I still have zero clue why. Like, it got to the point where they even scanned this man's ass to see if he had anal beans in his next chess match. Crazy world we live in. Rockstar got hit by a huge hack which led to early development footage of GTA 6 getting leaked. This is just crazy considering the fact that they finally told us something at the start of the year. And it was one thing just confirming that the game was even developing. So I know when they saw this hack, they shit the f out of their pants. Twitch yep. banned gambling sites from their website they after did. streamers threatened to strike. Pretty much putting streamers out of jobs overnight. Emphasis on Aiden Ross and Trainwrecks when I'm talking about streamers that gamble. Jeffrey Dahmer the But Trainwreck literally said he said for life, bro. I, he, he literally released how much he got paid from the contracts, boy. He said for life. Series released on Netflix, breaking the previous Stranger Things record with a three- uh, I have yet to see this Jeffrey Dahmer thing. I have yet to see it.
I just I just seen the memes about it. 2.7 billion minutes streamed in the first week on Netflix and giving some women once again another absolutely unhinged man to cling on because they have nothing better to do. The UK police arrested the person responsible for hacking Rockstar Games, which turned out to be some 17 year old kid doing it on his room's computer. Bro's definitely getting the death penalty. The Simon streamed their football charity match with yep. some of the biggest YouTubers and content creators there, raising over 1 million pounds to four different charities and at the same time also becoming the seventh most watched YouTube live stream with two. 2.5 million concurrent people. The seventh, I didn't know that. successfully crashed a spacecraft into an asteroid to test if they could prevent asteroids from hitting Earth in the future. Should have let it just hit Earth, but hey, that's just me. Florida got hit with oh, okay. Hurricane Ian, which lasted approximately a week. They got warned by the government to leave ASAP and were ordered to evacuate immediately. And of course, because they're from Florida, they didn't listen. I swear, people from Florida, Floridians. they like God and went. You were called to evacuate for a reason. And now you're stuck in a house flooded and completely devastated. And we ended off the month with some pretty sad news. Sadly, Coolio passed away. He did. Rest in peace. AKA the man known for creating one of the most safest songs to play on any ox, Gangsta's Paradise. Rest in peace, Coolio. The memes of this month were things like the queen passing away, the wise mystical tree, Adam Levine's cheating text, and can we get much higher One Piece? October 2022. Oh, this month God. might have been the most packed out of all of them. On the second day of the month only, this happened. <laughs> Yeah, so Dream's face reveal proved to be one thing. People on the internet are just f***ing me. The amount of slander Dream got this day was just absolutely unheard of. You had people oh, calling him Lord Farquaad, saying he looked like Humpty Dumpty, saying he looks like Prince Charming from Shrek, all around just throwing dirt and kicking him to the ground. And after this because of y'all, I guarantee long-time channels that are faceless aren't going to do face reveals anytime soon. Oh, also, we finally made it back to Kanye. Kanye wore a White Lives Matter shirt with Candace Owens, certifying his villain arc start. Tom Brady and his wife divorced after 13 yep. years of marriage and back to kanye kanye made a little tweet on twitter that got him in a lot of trouble now i'm obviously not gonna read it or say it but just know it's a tweet not wishing that's right he's ugly what group of european people his account was banned a day after that tweet yay really started to face the cancellation at this point chase bang banned him for his anti-semitic comments and on the same day his buddy alex jones <laughs> that's crazy how the bank banned you that's crazy was ordered to pay 965 million dollars to sandy hook victims in a lawsuit like what do you even do at that point in your life you're not paying that off ever you're still gonna have to work to pay it off anyways you're his net worth online doesn't even have a positive number. That's almost a negative. billion, bro. Back to Kanye. Kanye West went on Drink Champs interview. Now, I'm not sure if I can show this footage anymore. But all you need to know is that he said things that no one can defend. Yep. Saying stuff like George Floyd didn't die from the knee on his neck. Which he would later get sued a couple days later by the family. Yeah. Yep. $250 million lawsuit. Okay, everyone knows Kanye said something completely out of pocket and it should have never been said ever. But a $250 million lawsuit chill, is chill, chill. crazy in Listen, my Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. All the companies real quick that cut ties with Ye after this. So we can just move on with the video. Adidas, Balenciaga, uh -huh. yep. Gap, CAA, yep. MRC yep. Entertainment, yep. Vogue, Foot Locker, uh -huh. Skechers, uh -huh. and yep. TJ Maxx. Uh -huh. All these cut ties from these companies made him officially not a billionaire anymore, making him only worth $500 million. And I don't know why I'm saying only, considering the fact that it's $500 million. It's Elon Musk officially. He still got to pay Kim 200k a month. It's crazy. Officially bought Twitter it's for awesome. 44 billion dollars on October 27th, making one of the single dumbest purchases committed by any billionaire. Also, Modern Warfare 2 released, which for the shock to COD fans, actually came out pretty good. This is considering the fact like everybody did mm. not like the past four CODs and everybody came together for this one. They were like, yeah, it's, it's, it's actually good. Memes for this month were things like Dreams Face Reveal, Ohio, yep. Can We Get Much Higher, and the Mario movie, November 2022. We started okay. off this month, honestly, with just the worst type of news. November 1st, 2020 rapper takeoff was shot and killed he it was, was a shot very and killed. sad rest day in peace. A huge loss for the rap community and what's worse was that it shouldn't even have happened rest in paradise to take off and rest in peace to one of the greatest rap trios to ever happen at the same time the six i remember it was like i think like two weeks right after they uh google uh fixed it to saying that uh, the amigos is a duo Set up a trio. That's that's even more so. The community started to blow up even more for some reason. I think this was due to Andrew Tate getting banned or something, and all these red pill dudes with kids posting TikTok Sigma edits and possibly you lost generating the, first the worst day. content the platform has ever seen. Drake released her loss, which was a collab album with Twenty One Savage, and to good. everyone's surprise, it was actually good. Drake definitely had something snap inside him after. Honestly, never mind. God of War Ragnarok released on November 9th, did, yeah. breaking a record of selling more than 5.1 million copies first week on PS4 and PS5, which again is one. 
one of the best games this year by far. The FTX scandal. Now, this is way too what much to explain, and I have too tiny of a brain to do it, but I'll just give the gist of it. On November 11th, 2022, FTX, which was a big cryptocurrency exchange, Crypto filed again. for Chapter 11 bankruptcy. And at the same time, their CEO, Sam Bankman Fried, stepped down from the position, pretty much destroying the company overnight. Meaning that if you had any type of Something money in your crypto oh, okay, wallet for buddy. FTX, that that's kind of bad, yo. Imagine waking up and checking your bank account, and all your money disappeared from it in a day. It's just crazy to even think about. But hey, at least Black Panther Wakanda Forever released the same day. Trump I've yet to see Black Panther movie still. I've yet to see. I but now go that see he's it. running for president in 2024, the he world is. hit 8 billion people. And now we can get to the no-no brand. Balenciaga. Now, I'm not yep, going to fully done. explain what they did in this video in hope of keeping this monetized. But I think most of us know by now, and I'll just give a little drawing of it. So, this is the brand. And after the scandal, this is them. Make sense now? Elon Musk yep. started to make changes to Twitter, like adding the ability to buy a verification badge. That is stupid. I hate that. I hate that. That's there's just no point in being verified on Twitter that like I I can be verified at the amount of followers I have. I don't have the following on Twitter. Like that's kind of unfair for the people that are like, you know what I'm saying? And unbanning the controversial suspended accounts like Andrew Tate, Donald Trump, Kanye West, Jordan Peterson, etc. Unleashing the holy villains to the public once again. But don't worry because Kanye got banned once again a month later. The Qatar World Cup Shock. officially started on November 20. And World Qatar Cup. became the first country to ever host the World Cup while simultaneously losing the fastest. Does anyone know hmm. how long Qatar's team was even in the World Cup? It also got exposed that they don't pretty know. much built all those stadiums in the country using immigrant slaves from other countries. Okay. And they admitted themselves over 500 people died just making the stadium so wow that really happened just for your country to lose first wednesday released on netflix breaking the yeah to see wednesday the previous record on netflix with over 411 million hours viewed on its debut and once again giving down bad guys another girl to simp over that they'll never get jenna ortega's hype needs to be honestly studied in the future the fact that she really gained 10 million followers and yo because i followed jenna ortega a long time because she had a show on disney uh, channel a while back so i can't even say like i knew her since then because y'all gonna be like no 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 you don't see what i mean and after her follower count shoot up she was at a cool like what less than, she was at less than 10 months for a while and then she just shot up bro 10 days like, I just checked it recently. She's at like 30 something million. It just shows the male species cannot be saved. No wonder people like Andrew Tate popped up this year. The memes of. Yeah, why he played that like Ohio still for some. Stuck in the middle. There it is. Yep. For some reason. The cod ghost face. <laughs> I love this meme. It's. The Mm, no, nah, the noise, bro. LeBron James capping. And just the World Cup in general. December 2022. The last month oh, of the God. year wasn't. December gang. Too much. Kanye starts it off by being in the headlines again when he went on out no, no, no. wars and said a lot of let's just say bad things to yeah. a certain group of European people while also praising the man that led to a lot of their ancestors demise. At this point even the most meat riding Kanye fans decided that they were officially done with him. There was literally no- Nah, the, nah some of the memes on Twitter they were, they were kind of funny. It was like but he made graduation but he made graduation. <laughs> <laughs> defending what he said like it was humanly impossible trump's organization got caught in 4k and was found guilty on all counts of criminal tax fraud which wow. isn't even talked about a lot like i feel like this should be much more important than it is britney griner was officially released from prison after a prison swap between i'm glad britney griner got a deeper voice than me i ain't gonna catch y'all um no this is not me this is not me never mind this is not me got everybody pissed the fuck off with how we could even be embarrassed like this ask 99 percent of americans and i guarantee they would say no to the swap if they found out the man they were trading was named the merchant of death the governor of texas officially banned tiktok on all state issued devices which you might think is not important but right after this congress introduced a bill to ban tiktok in the entire united states they meaning did. that people would actually have to go outside and start getting jobs r kelly released an album from in jail yeah. jail it was called i admit it that's all i'm it did apple and it like all spotify apple soundcloud all the music platforms they took it down immediately Insane. the game awards happened as well with huge games winning awards this year obviously like elden ring and god of war ragnarok of and the most important thing of all out of the entire game awards you know real quick i want to thank everybody and say that i think i want to nominate this award to, uh, my Who's this? Bill oh, who the fuck? Gunner was released from jail on December 14th. At
Uh, Takashi uh, said that, um, what's it called, that gunner snitched to get out of jail. After pleading guilty. Some people say he did snitch. Some people said he didn't snitch. But if we're being honest, he definitely did. And to end oh, off okay. the entire year of 2022, the World Cup finally ended by Argentina winning at the end in penalties. Yep. Making Messi the official go to football. And with that being said, I hate to admit it. He's right. Said the year of 2022 is officially. I always thought Nada was a go. Possibly one of the most fast-paced, moving, and back-to-back -back things happening in a year for some time now. I obviously couldn't include everything, and I'd probably lose my mind because the video would be like two hours long. But I just personally wanted to make this and do this concept more creative than I've seen. Also, I'm gonna be cliche for a second. Thank you for everybody that watches my videos. We honestly grew an insane amount this year, and I was not expecting that my first year coming back to YouTube. And if you're watching this in the future, please just tell me. Shout to the homie. Better. Like I can't stand this anymore. I can't do it. These users are just getting worse and worse. Like, follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok. As always, I love you guys consensually. And until next time, I'm out. That's fine. That's fine. Shout out to the homie. This is a great video. It's a really good video. L December's. Okay, that's kind of crazy. I just upgraded my status. I put on Dior because I just love fashion. Let's make the play for the pad. He's tapping. Tell him I should be the